Hello. <laughs> We, I have been for the last half an hour searching who was with Dixie Chicks. I searched for Tim McGraw, Luke Bryan, George Strait, Brad Paisley, Alan Jackson, Kenny Chesney, all of those. And I just told my sister, I just can't remember who it was. So she's on the Fort Wayne Coliseum. I never even thought about looking that. It's not on Dixie Chicks either. I already checked. Um, I'm looking. It's it has to be. It has, to be. It has I, to be. We're dying. To I do remember it was a younger guy with a really tight bottom. <laughs> <laughs> Today we're gonna do a couple different projects along with trying to figure out who this was. I've looked at everything. I've even looked at the venue that we were at. We can't find it. Um, we're gonna do a couple little projects. I can't wait to show you what we're doing. Deb's gonna do that switch right now, so I will be recording that. Um, then we are going to go to a salvage place where <clears throat> here in Greensboro, I believe, where we're hoping we can find a really cool fireplace mantle. If you want a recap of the antique places that we went to here in the Greensboro, North Carolina area, it's going to all be listed in our newsletter on Sunday. So make sure that you sign up. We are doing something so fun tomorrow. You need to stay tuned to stories. I cannot wait. I'll discuss it a little bit more later, but my stories are so full. Deb is teaching my sister, Deb. I'm gonna tag her here. I had a bunch of questions about what her account was to change, how to change out a dimmer switch. So she's gonna be posting that on her story since mine are full. few mantles here that one there's two there but these aren't big enough this one is big oh Deb this is only 125 this bigger white one is only And that one's pretty tall. Then they have this one, which I love that. I think this might go on top of that, which would be really cool. Do you think? Let's try to lift it up there and see. Okay, so this is a different fireplace mantle. That's the top to it. But I think I like this up here and then have Deb add another board behind here. You guys know I'm at my sister's house and I just asked her if she's ever tried the Pose Travel Mirror by Vanity Planet. She had not. I brought it down and she is thoroughly impressed. So I wanted to show you what it is. So this is what it looks like. It is slim so it tucks down in your bags easily. It is rechargeable or chargeable. You open it up and it sets up like this on the counter so you can apply your makeup. Touch this little area here and it lights up. Hold it down and the light dims. It does have an on off switch on the back as well. This is perfect if you work in a little cubicle. I always wanted one of these for my desk. I am going to put my link here, tap through it for 60% off. Uh, it should, my code should auto apply, but that mirror is perfect for gym bag, traveling, desk drawer, car etc. And if you get the bundle, you get that size mirror and you get a smaller one. So you could give it away as gifts as well. I'm going to put my link here again, tap through it for 60% off. So we're, um, 
doing a few little projects. I'm going to post one that we recorded a little earlier, but I want to show you something fun that we're going to do. This is a stained glass piece that my sister had in her basement. So we think we want to hang this here above her island in the kitchen. So we will show you. We'll show you when we do it. Do you remember my heartbeat when you were in my womb? Do you remember that? <laughs> Listening to mommy's heartbeat. He is, he is traumatized right now. <laughs> we made the decision to hang that directly in the middle of the window so that way those two match and if this is off just a little bit it's not going to be that noticeable we've determined that the beams run this way so we are going to which is good so we're going to put a couple of these in the window and these in the ceiling a whole lot of wonderful surprise oh, the beams oh, run this way that. like that way to go, but they dropped the yeah. ceiling and added beams this way so we had to so, so we were right compromise deb and danelle they're coming to see me in greenville i cannot wait I have never met them in person. We've done all the homie tours together. We've chatted for years now. And they're coming to see me. I'm gonna get to meet them tomorrow. So you're gonna have to stay tuned for that because you know I'll be showing it in stories and I can not wait. You're looking smashing. You know, my wife is unbelievable. It's I mean, I feel like a blessed awesome. man to every day look over and go, <laughs> Look at what I, <laughs> the Lord is blessing me. Let's take an inventory. Who's getting mad? Not me, because I don't give a shit. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm not mad either. We are playing Five Crowns hey, again. Can I just say something? Yeah. Yes. Take a good look at me now. Wait, what is it? What's the music? Oh, it's I love this song. Bill Collins. Can I ask a question? Yes. Who's upset? <laughs>